Welcome back to the Lockout Man Podcast show. Thank you. Thank you for watching. I really do appreciate it. Shout out to my subscribers that be hooking me up with these videos to react to on TikTok. But before we get started, yo, why don't you do me a favor and help a brother out? You can do that by hitting the like button, subscribe button, and the thank you button to show support for the channel. Thank you very much. Let's just jump right into this TikTok reaction, man. Yo! Ladies, especially in the trucking, I, I really want to I really want to bring this question out because I knew a few of you guys, uh, social media types that went through the process of getting the weight loss surgery. Now, in this particular video right here, you know, it's not much going on. It's just a little voiceover. But baby, I mean, I know you had the surgery and you must have been some type of way, you know. Hold on. If you're a fat girl, I need you to put your big body in a two-piece this summer. 2021, I need everybody, and I'm not talking about no high-waisted two-piece. I'm talking about a real two-piece. I need that stomach hanging. I need a fupa hanging. I need them fat rolls out. I need a cheap. No shade. Shout out to, you know, what you did. You probably did it for health reasons, beauty reasons, or whatever the case reasons, but yo, I mean, I, I guess you was like at one at one size one point you went and got the surgery and booyah you're down to whatever at but you got all this extra skinage, skinage, you know it's like how a balloon deflates, you know what I'm saying? But you have all this extra skinage. How how do you go by? And molding that into, you know, toning it down. Hold on. If you're a fat girl, I need you to put your big body in a two-piece this summer. 2021, I need everybody. And I'm not talking about no high-waisted two-piece. I'm talking about a real two-piece. I need that stomach hanging. I need a fupa hanging. I need them fat rolls out. I need a cheek. Now, dude, is it required exercise? Maybe another surgery? How how do you go in and and get some of that toned down? That's what I like to know. But for the ladies, you know, a few of y'all, and I know one personally, you know, and I, I knew of her journey. And, you know, she told me, you know, she she told me her story of the process of going over to Mexico and getting the surgery done over there because over in Mexico, it's a little bit cheaper. Not as not as expensive as it is over here. She says over here is like getting the surgery. It's like two times the price, but it was less over in Mexico. So she went down there. She got the surgery and everything, and she came back looking good. Now, my question is this. Once you get half of your stomach taken out, how do you how do you maintain the shape. Hold on. If you're a fat girl, I need you to put your big body in a two-piece this summer. 2021, I need everybody. And I'm not talking about no high-waisted two-piece. I'm talking about a real two-piece. I need that stomach hanging. I need a fupa hanging. I need them fat rolls out. I need a cheek. You know what I'm saying? Do, do you continue to work out or whatever the case? Do you? Do, do the surgery? Can the surgery be in reverse? too i'm just curious but like i said i you know i came across of a few uh tiktokers and across uh internet uh across not the internet but across instagram and i knew and i know of several popular uh instagram truck uh trucking ladies that went through the procedure you know they was at one point <laughs> wow and now they're at a you know they wow factor is times 10 now you know what i'm saying but i'm just kind of curious to know like when you got into trucking right was trucking the reason why you had the procedure done and wonder why i'm saying it that way because trucking kind of allowed you to make the kind of money needed to get the procedure done you know, I'm I'm thinking, you know, the the surgery costs an upwards of maybe two, three, 
or five grand. And of course, working at Amazon or any other low level place, I'm sure you couldn't afford that. So was trucking a reason, you know, that you said, well, hey, you know, I got this weight. I'm trying to make something happen. Let me jump into trucking so I can make this money and make it happen. Was it that it for you? Let me know in the comments below. All right. Let me know in the comments below, because like I said, I, I came across a, 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 a couple of couple of ladies that had the procedure done. Looks great, by the way. Hold on. If you're a fat girl, I need you to put your big body in a two piece this summer. 2021, I need everybody. And I'm not talking about no high waisted two piece. I'm talking about a real two piece. I need that stomach hanging. I need a fupa hanging. I need them fat rolls out. I need a cheap. Well. Some of you do anyway, <laughs> but I'm just saying still was trucking the reason why you got the surgery or was trucking an asset for you to get the surgery or was the surgery was the reason why you got into trucking. Let me know in the comments below. All right. That's going to do it. I appreciate you guys listening. Thank you very much for the support of the Lockout Men podcast channel. Shout out to my channel members that always rock out with me. Y'all can support the channel any way it goes. All the pieces matter. All the pieces matter. You know what I'm saying? You can hit the join button. You can hit the thank you button. Like, subscribe. I mean, like, subscribe. Hell, even watch the commercials. That that's the support that I need for the channel to let YouTube know that is growing expeditiously. You guys want to send me some videos, or you guys want to come on for a conversation? Hit me up two one six six zero zero two zero nine zero. And until next time, everybody, y'all stay tuned for the next one. Peace. I'm like Beethoven with the bass on it. Me, classic kids, it went pop. Death to the hater won't stop. Let's talk key scales, it won't drop. You don't even need a scale to know I'm on top. Me and Mozart, could bars, you got bops. Heard you writing Tiffany, a whole symphony. You a symptom, me, but go off. I'll make a masterpiece for you, or at least it's gonna hit like rump, bump, bump. Y'all fit to me like this symphony. Your career's done, done, done.